If you're a thrill seeker or if you think you're brave enough to handle even the most extreme of rides, then you've come to the right place. Number 5. Macau Tower Bungee Jump Bungee jumping is an extreme sport that has quickly taken the world by storm, with jumping spots being started up all over the world. Now while bungee jumping is itself an extreme sport, there are some who want to take it to the next level. And those are the people who go to the Macau Tower Jump, the tallest bungee jump in the entire world which is a staggering 764 feet in the sky. That's taller than a 70 story building. A jump from the Macau Tower is a quite an extreme and expensive luxury that will set you back around $1,000. However, those who love the thrill will do anything for an adrenaline rush. Number 6. The Tilt Do you ever get that feeling when you look out of a window in a tall building? Well, multiply that by a thousand and you might have an idea of what the tilt in Chicago's John Hancock building is all about. This truly unique attraction actually manages to make money from people who want to be scared. The tilt is an eight station hydraulic experience where visitors are placed against a slightly tilted window overlooking Chicago from 1,128 feet in the sky. The see-through glass does provide a majestic view of the windy city, sometimes letting people as far as 50 miles away the feeling of awe quickly turns to terror as they crank up the fear factor. The glass platform literally tilts towards the ground, slowly at first, giving a slightly better view of the ground all the way down. Thankfully, there are handrails along the sides, which visitors understandably tend to grip very firmly on the final tilt, and the bulletproof glass is strong enough to hold up an elephant. Number 7. Ladder to Heaven Austria is home to some incredible rock mountains attracting thousands of adventurous climbers and hikers every year. However, sometimes certain sections of mountains aren't able to be scaled by hand, making reaching mountain peaks impossible for all but the most gifted climbers. That's where Via Ferretis come in. These wire staircases connect parts of trails that would be otherwise impossible, but don't be fooled. That doesn't mean it makes them easy. The Ladder to Heaven, located in Donnerkogel in Austria, is one such Via Ferretta with a very high difficulty level. And that's not the only thing that's high. This simple wire ladder hangs 2,300 feet above the ground, allowing climbers to cross an impassable gorge. Number 8. Cage of Death Anyone with an insane hunger for danger should head straight to Darwin, Australia, where I assure you, your appetite will be satisfied. However, if you're a little more sane, you'll definitely want to stay as far away from this crazy place down under as possible. Darwin is home to the Cage of Death, which is certainly an inviting name. In this underwater acrylic enclosure, which forms part of the Crocosaurus Cove Aquarium, visitors can take a dip in a small pool with a human eating crocodile surrounding you at all times. Australian crocodiles can grow to sizes between 15 to 20 feet, and in the cage of death, adrenaline junkies can watch these reptilian apex predators feed, swim, and even snap their massive jaws from an arm's length away. The crocodiles often pass by with a toothy smile if they weren't underwater. You could probably see their mouths watering at the sight of a human, a tasty, tasty human snack. Visitors go through a brief safety course before taking the big plunge, but otherwise, as one online review claims, all you can do is cower in fear. Number 9. CN Tower Edge Walk For 32 years, the CN Tower in Toronto, Canada was the tallest building on the planet, only surpassed by the colossal Burj Khalifa building in Dubai in 2007. Still, runner-up in this case is still very high up, and the massive radio tower serious adrenaline junkies can take a wall on the wild side of the CN Tower edge walk. A completely open platform, 1,168 feet in the sky, no guardrails, no walls, just a bungee cord attached to a security rail connecting visitors to the building, and a whole lot of nothing between you and the ground. I don't know about you, but I get vertigo from the inside of the tall buildings, so the CN Tower edge walk is not exactly on my bucket list. Number 10. Zip World Velocity Wales isn't exactly a place most people think of as thrilling, but what if I tell you that Wales is home to one of the craziest and most incredible extreme attractions in the world? Enter the Velocity 2 Zipline, also known as the fastest zipline on Earth. This specially positioned zipline was designed with speed in mind, accelerating those brave enough to ride it from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 10 seconds. And it doesn't stop there. The steep rideable wire zooms guessed along its length at up to 125 miles per hour, which, for reference, is the legal speed limit for trains in all of England. Damn, that might, it's a crazy one, yay! 
if you manage to keep your eyes open during the trip, the ground wave below will look nothing like more than just a blur, and the wind in your ears might be able to drown you out how loud your heart is beating. This is it for today, see you in the next video.